Thank you very much, and I truly appreciate that uh, you invited me uh, to join you, to participate uh, in this important uh, and relevant discussion that we need to do uh, regarding now how currently uh, technology in the world, science and technology and innovation are developing across the world. We now are saying that uh, these technologies, the new technologies, are exponential and disruptive. Uh, and in fact, they are also creating exponential and disrupt disruptive uh, innovations that destroy and create. So the important question now is that how do we relate these technologies to the social and economic development? for many uh, countries in the world, including, and in, in, in our case, of course, particularly in Africa. This is an important question that we need to address, and it's very important uh, that we focus on it, as this technology is becoming now very, very uh, uh, powerful, and we are now, uh, the world is now, in what's called uh, an economy where big data, connectivity, artificial intelligence, Internet of Things, all are impacting on the world as it is now. So we need to really uh, explore this exponential technology to see what, how new developments can be made and, and, uh, and, and, and how the current smartphones, the mobile miracle, all this are impacting on how we used to do things and these are now changing technologically. What does it mean uh, in terms of all the existing practices we used to do and the new ones that are emerging? This is an important question that we need to address. And that's, uh, thank you for inviting me and let's now start and discussing it. We have a journal, uh, African Journal of Science, Technology, Innovation, Development, and really some extraordinary uh, uh, output has come through this on the technology and some of these issues that I discussed, especially on agriculture. Um, we also did a book on African economic transformation in the digital age. So we have really addressed some of these important points I just mentioned to you, have been mentioned in our book, which we published last year. And then we have also published a new book this year, also on regional integration and innovation. So I think we're working on this seriously. And the problem now is how to influence the policymakers to assist this process because they shouldn't be thinking of, uh, they can't transform agriculture in the old way. It has to be done through this new, new exponential technology. The main blessing, trust me, that, and I'm glad yesterday you heard this Professor Wu talking how the Chinese are doing it. Why shouldn't we in Africa do it? Where the Chinese may be doing it in the e-commerce sector, we can do it in the real sector. So I think that's very, very important. We also have this uh, journal which is called The Thinker, and uh, I, I hope a lot of you will get a chance to read it.